Hey, what's up boys and girls? This is Dernity T from Twitch. I just would like to show you a small video how to install the uh, Stream Deck plugins on uh, your computer for controlling your uh, Logitech Litra Glow and Beam on your PC, on your Stream Deck. So I build um, with the help of AI, the Stream Deck plugin based on uh, another project which is using command line prompt to control the Lytra light because the only the only Stream Deck plugin or a way to get it worked silently on the computer um, without getting some commands and command prompt appears during gameplay or during uh, streaming because you run a CLI command. Um, I build with the, a, uh, with the help of AI, with Cursor AI, um, a plugin that's control everything with that library and it's only three easy steps to do it guys it's really really nice so let me show you first to install um, the library uh, on your computer and the stream deck and everything you go to my github that I create uh, yesterday um, which is uh, from eternity litra glow the instruction is right here. You go on the installation section. Uh, the first step you need to do is to install Node.js, a JavaScript library to run uh, Node commands on Windows. You install that. So you visit this page, you click on Windows Installer MSI, you run uh, the installer, you install, you follow all the steps. Just next, 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 yes, 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 that's all. Once you've do that, um, you come back right here and you copy the command npm install dot dot save lytra so what you need to do is to open powershell run as an administrator you paste the command and you hit it enter as you can see it's installed the library up to date uh, audited 22 package it says up to date because i already installed and it's working well so the next step you can test if the command, uh, if the Lytra is running on your system. So you just paste the new copy. And as you can see, it has detect the Lytra glow uh, light, which is connected and the status is off. The last uh, brightness was 64 lumens and temperature is 2700 Kelvin, which is good. Um, and it's uh, using that uh, to identify your lights and control your light. So you need the Lytra uh, library that we install. And the last step is to download the Stream Deck plugin and install it. That's all, guys. You go up right here on the list. You click on the Stream Deck plugin. You click the little three dot. You download. Once you download it, you run it. You, it's going to have a pop-up if you would like to install the Lytra Stream Deck plugin. You click yes. And as you can see, it's installed on the right section. You have a new section called Lytra Glow Control. And you have five actions. You have the toggle on off. Uh, you have temperature brightness down and plus, which is increment from 10% lower to 10% upper from the current status that it was on and temperature down and temperature up on the same basic principle from 400 kelvin so between 27 and 65,000. so what you need to do is you drag and drop when the light is closed it's white status when you click on it as you can see i click on my stream deck the lights come on and the light is yellow to show you that it's open you can close it back it is close it back so for the brightness situation, uh, you have a plus and a minus. Every time you do a click on your stream deck, it's going to raise or lower from 10% difference. So if you do two click, it's going to lower to 20%. If you do two clicks, it's going to uh, raise the, the brightness to 20% low. So it's using the current status. Every time you do an action, it's it's getting a request to your light what's the current status um what's the current percentage and it's modify the value uh to the proper um settings that you click on it so you have the same thing for the temperature as you can see right here so you have um warm and cooler section so every time you do a click uh, it's gonna raise the temperature from it 
So I just would like to mention, and I'm not a programmer, I use the help with AI uh, to build a stream deck from the SDK and the SDK CLI and on the uh, library from the guy who built the uh, library Litra, which is allow you to control your Litra from command line. And I use the command line to be uh, managed by Node to send the request to your lights and getting the status and everything, which is well documented. So I was able with all the documentation and with the help of AI to implement something for your Stream Deck. The only one thing that I would like to mention is that my Stream Deck plugin doesn't allow you to control two different Logitech lights for now because... This is the beginning of my test, which has working well, and I'm really proud of it. So I publish uh, to every, everyone, if you would like to get your Stream Deck um, plugin installed pretty much easily, and uh, it has worked well. The next step I would like to do with it is to install a second liter of light, and maybe on the Stream Deck right here, choose which one you would like to control. And put a label on it, maybe like a label for uh, left one or right one. So when you put on your stream deck, you associate the serial number of the device. And uh, you're going to know it's the left one, the right one. So you will be able maybe to drag and drop two different ones. Select which one and associate with the light that you have. I think it's going to be a really good feature for me. Because I have two different same light. But for now, they are on both different PC, one on my streaming PC and one on my uh, gaming PC because I have two stream deck, but it's not a case of everyone. So maybe I'm going to do it. I need to check if I have the money right now to renew the subscription for Cursor because my subscription is now ended. I, have, I was having a 30, day tri a 30 days trial and I do some couple of uh, stuff with it. So maybe if I have uh, some money income later because I'm a streaming and I'm working on a computer, so uh, computer and IT support. So and I'm moving in a couple of weeks. So um, pretty much right now tight. But if you like the feature, you can write me down. Uh, you can come say hi on Twitch and uh, visit me. And if you like the if you like the project, uh, give me a star, guys. And if you like uh, my project go also like um, the project of uh, that guy because without that guy um, if I wasn't have um, that library getting work uh, I wasn't able to do the Stream Deck plugin without this uh, important uh, library so give also a star because that uh, library is well maintained working well and uh, maybe later I'm going to try to evolve the Stream Deck plugin to get it work maybe with the RGB one, but I doesn't have the money right now to purchase a RGB one. Uh, I know uh, Logitech has released a newer model, which is called Logitech Beam RGB, which is the newer version, and uh, <clears throat> it's dual side in RGB. So I don't know if the library Tim Rogers uh, is work with the RGB. I doesn't remember i didn't check so no there is no mention about rgb uh, on the feature so maybe we can has a feature for him and implement a feature um another thing is i'm not sure if it's worked on mac os but i think it's gonna work on mac os if you have a mac because um it's mentioned here that it this project is also working with mac so you can install on Mac. If I remember, it says um, uh, only tested on Mac OS, Monterey and Windows 11. So I think it can work, but get in tryout. The only one thing you need to do is to install Node, which is also available uh, to Mac OS. I mean, if you go right here, you can select on Mac OS and install on Mac OS and... Um, get it work on mac os install the lytra and try it out maybe i'm gonna try it on my macbook air soon uh, which has the latest um, like sequoia version which is i'm gonna try out later with the capture card and show you and give you some news about it but anyways the video is going too long but guys i'm really 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 enjoyed that uh, that stream deck plugin and uh, enjoy it if you like it drop a follow Drop a stars on GitHub. Drop a star on the other guy. 
and uh, stay tuned for uh, some updates uh, with the Stream Deck plugins. Have a great day, guys. Bye-bye.